Hey guys, it is Crystal, and I'm here to do a wrap up of the first. Ooh, I almost said socket. The first week of December of what I read for my 200 page a day challenge, my my 100 books since I started BookTube challenge, and my challenge to finish all the books on my shelf that I have not hauled in November or December by the end of this year. Yay! Okay, so last week I did not read as much as I wanted to, but I read quite a bit. I read five books, and that takes my 100 book down to 24 books left, and that takes my, um, all the books that I read were books on my shelf that I haven't hauled since, um, since I've gotten, since November, or like, they're all, I don't know how to talk, they're all books that I have gotten before November, so that checks off the first two, and then the third one is how my 200 pages a day is going, I think this averages out to about 200 pages a day, because a lot of these books were at least two, 300 pages, and for each day, to read 200 pages in a week, it is... Hang on, guys. Gotta get a calculator because I can't do that in my math, in my head. 200 times 7. It's 1,400 pages. So, 300-ish pages times 5. Yeah, that's actually over the limit. But anyways, so here are the books that I read in the first week of November. The first one, not this isn't in any order, they're just kind of how they are in my stack. The first one is Lord of the Flies by William Golding. This book was alright. I I liked it, I guess. Kinda got really creepy really quickly, but it was alright. The next book that is in my stack is Betrayal in Paris by Doris Elaine Fell. This book took me the longest to get through. I kind of had a little bit of confusion following certain people and their role because it was a lot of, like, mistaken identities type of thing. I don't know. It was good. Um, the next one that I picked up is Forensic Detective by Robert Mann. And this one didn't take me very long at all. I think this one took me, like, a night. A night or two with, like, maybe an hour reading. It wasn't very long and it was just... Kind of something that you didn't really need to focus on a lot. The next book that I read was Eve by Anna Carey. And I ordered the next two off of Amazon. So I should be getting them soon. Because I lit, I really liked it and I wanted to read more. And then finally I read Scavenger by David Morrell. This is an adult book and I was really surprised at how much I liked it because I liked it a lot. But anyways, those are the first five books that I read for the first week of November. I am currently reading Onyx. I am about like 103 pages away from finish finishing it. Hopefully I will finish it tonight after I finish all my homework. And then tomorrow I'll be able to start Opal. Tomorrow I probably won't start and finish Opal just because I have a lot to do. But I will at least try and get like 200 pages into it for my 200 pages a day challenge. But anyways, I will see you guys in my next video, which will come out tomorrow, I do believe. Bye-bye!